throw now. Harbaugh calls the signals on third and short. Takes the ball to Perriman. Keeps it himself around the right side. He's in the clear. Touchdown, Jimmy Harbaugh. Harbaugh. That's Jim Harbaugh back in 86. Quarterback for the University of Michigan Wolverines. All-American. Heisman Trophy finalist. BMOC. And look back there. Behind the chick with the pom-poms. The dude with the feathered hair. That's me. Male football cheerleader. I know. It's a long story. Anyway, three decades later, Jim is back home in Ann Arbor, Michigan. Me too. You seen this? Yes, I have. Remember it. Remember me? You're right there. Yeah, how's your hair doing? Uh, it's okay. Harbaugh's football royalty, 14 years in the NFL, coached against his brother John in Super Bowl 47. He recently left the NFL to coach the Wolverines to bring respectability and championships back to a proud football power. Why well, here's like you can get paid more someplace, huh? A decision from the heart. I uh, grew up here, went to school here, uh, was a student athlete here at Michigan, and I have a great love for Michigan. Hold that for me, I still got what is it. Go blue! Bra bravo. Thank you. The money doesn't hurt either. Harbaugh will earn $5 million a year, making him one of the highest paid college coaches in America and the highest paid public servant in the state of Michigan. It's like that all over the USA. Consider the top 50 college coaches last year earned a combined $165 million. As a comparison, the 50 governors of the United States earned a combined $6.5 million. I mean, I love football, but you gotta ask, have we lost our minds? Are you worth the money? No. Well, then give it back. <laughs> now, I like making a buck just like the next guy. And, uh, yeah, it's uh, not doing five times as much work as, as somebody else or, or doing more work than somebody that's, uh, you know, not the head football coach at the University of Michigan. So to answer your question, honestly, I would have to, have to say no. Wow. So if you took a pay cut, you think all the rest of the coaches in major college football would take a pay cut? I don't know. Want to see? Uh, no. Fair question, but uh, as I said, I'm willing to work for it. College football rakes in more than three and a half billion dollars a year, but only 20 schools, including Michigan, make money on football. The rest need to drain cash from the taxpayers and students to maintain the team. So fewer wins means fewer dollars, which translates into higher tuition or fewer yeah. male cheerleaders. Yeah, you, and nobody uh, wants that. Go blue! Go blue! The math is simple. Just win, Jim. I can do a lot of push-ups. How many can you do? In a row? Yeah. 60. Nice. You? Uh, probably could do 25 in a row. Want to do them with me? No. <laughs> oh, come on, that would be great TV. Uh, you're doing good, you're doing good. Knock out 60 right now. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, four, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Could you be more coachy about it? 19, I'm using 20, 21, 22. Coach. 58. Change your arm angle. 59. 60. Go blue. In terms of the uh, of the value to the university, um, I think he'll uh, he'll probably be worth it. Is there something a little bit unusual that he's paid much more than the? Uh, uh, than the university president or much more than anybody else uh, on campus. Uh, you know, that's the way uh, the world is. There's also the education part. Remember, athletes don't get paid, they get scholarships. Michigan prides itself not only on its football tradition, but also its academic achievements. First public university in the United States. 20 Pulitzer Prize winners. Seven Nobel Prize winners, one President of the United States, the Unabomber, 
but maybe not so much him. Can a guy get an education and put all the time in that you expect of? Yeah, I mean, when he's when he's uh, he or she is is motivated to do so, then uh, you you will get out of it what you put into it. And Michigan tries to be very serious. Um, you know, we, uh, I, I don't think you'll hear a Michigan player saying uh, what Cardale Jones said uh, about Ohio State that you know didn't come here here for the school. But you don't uh, need to take a stab at Ohio State. We're, we're talking Michigan. Oh, yeah, just keep on uh, keep uh, on top. Uh, of it. Oh, just keep on. Uh, oh, I always I was I was like taking a stab. Provincialism. At, I, I always like taking a stab at Ohio State if I can. Michigan football. It's back. Jim's back. I'm back. Backflip. Mm, do that, Eisen. Go blue.